Good evening. Today, scientists announced the discovery of the world's newest element, which they are calling Presentium. On February 14, 2023, researchers made headlines when they captured the newest element to be added to the periodic table. It is the 119th element with an atomic mass of 1044. Unlike other elements which are solid, gas, or liquid, Presentium is instead a noble force. The first of its kind. Scientists are amazed at the properties of Presentium, saying it defies all modern understanding and typical properties of the periodic table. This discovery is groundbreaking though and incredibly exciting. Presentium has physicists confounded as it pulses in and out of existence, 1,044 times per second. To date, researchers have not yet discovered how to pin it down. One moment it is there, visible, and the next moment it has disappeared. This noble force is thought to control our very human existence and may completely refute the Big Bang Theory entirely. What does this all mean for humanity? This understanding offers some really important guidance when it comes to gratitude. For gratitude to be a force that changes our life, we must feel it. It is not enough to know intellectually or mentally what you have to be grateful for. Gratitude must be embodied to work its magic. It needs to be absorbed and for it to be an instant and natural part of your life. Instead of looking for things to be fearful of, rather look for things to be grateful for. The only way to feel grateful and therefore to become gratitude is to connect with it in the present moment. Only in the present moment can we make this change. It is the only moment of life that counts. What happened in the past is immaterial. Let it go. The past has no bearing on the future. Only this present moment has that power. We can only connect to our power in this present moment. That's how creation works. It all happens from this present moment, in this present moment. So Presentium is obviously not a new element, but the concept of it represents rather well the potential we have to create happiness in the present moment. In our quantum world, what we perceive as reality is rapidly pulsing in and out of our worldly existence at Planck time, at roughly 1,044 times per second or 1,044 hertz. Our reality fluctuates between physical form and the source energy state of the field. Our vibrational consciousness dictates the universe, how the source energy will appear and what form it will take when it does appear. In this present moment, you have a resource you can use to change the future. You have an endless supply of it. You and I have an endless source of presentium, but you can only spend it in this moment of time. That means that you have only this present moment to affect your life. Tomorrow cannot do it, and for sure you cannot do it in the past. If you choose not to spend your presentium in the current moment, that resource is lost forever. However, in the next present moment, you are furnished with more presentium. Will you now choose to spend it? To give heartfelt gratitude for everything in your life? to decide to be happy right now. The currency of the universe is gratitude. How thankful would you be if your manifestation had arrived? Now have that heartfelt gratitude right now. Pay it forward. When you have paid the full price, the manifestation can only occur. You are using the laws of creation to create. Physically, that gratitude allowed you to vibrate at the level where your desired outcome exists. Due to the infinite nature of the frequency world we live in, everything exists. All outcomes exist. This moment right now has a specific electromagnetic frequency, a kind of a frequency signature. Due to the self-balancing nature of the world we live in, all good and all bad exist together. Consciousness is learning that you are powerful enough to only focus on the good and ignore the bad. I'm going to repeat that because this is the key to life. Consciousness is learning that you are powerful enough to only focus on the good and ignore the bad. If that's too hard for you, 
then be prepared to accept your current life as the rest of your life. Your choice. Everything is your choice. You create your world. What you frequent becomes your frequency. Consciousness is reality. Reality is this present moment. The field of infinite probability can only be accessed in this present moment. How will you spend your presentium?